Hi guys, this is me Ryan. I'm gonna be telling you guys how to make a cauldron activated secret door. It's really simple and this is all you would need. One water bucket, a empty bucket, it's two sticky pistons, two threshold comparators, one redstone torch, four redstone dust, really easy. As much any type of block of your choice, uh, some sort of other block. For, to make the place look good and the cauldron one cauldron so really easy so this is how it works so um wait let me cover this okay so you put the water in oh no put it up and it opens the door right here look old closed door and open door and if you want to close it come back here Close like that. Now we have a secret area. Now, if you want to open it back, really easy. Okay, do that. Wait, what? Oh, one sec. Oh, open up. Okay. So, first things first, you want to place down your cauldron. And then you want to. I'm going to try to make a line up. Oh, start away. Okay, right there. Easy. Place down one of these. Okay. Wait, what? Wait, one sec. I'm, I think I messed up on something. Okay, I did not. Sorry. So this is going to lead into a block. This is going to close this off. And now that would be my spin around. Okay. Place down. So you want to place down this part, right? Now it's like that. You don't really need to place this down, but you can still use the redstone thing. Oh, never mind. Sorry, guys. So you want to do this, right? So these bad boys. Guys, like here, like that. Okay, now I got it right. Okay. One sec. I feel like I messed up on something. Um. Okay, so this bad boy. Just like that. Easy. I should cancel. <laughs> now you can place down the block of your toys. I'm just going to use these furnaces, right? Now, this would mean if you do this, it turns off. The reason for this is. The reason for this is because. Should I look at that? It's because the comparator, like, I feel, it, like, takes fuel from other things. You can still do it with your chest, put, like, an item in it, and then it powers everything. So, I'll show you. So, yeah. And now, this inverts it, which will power this. And this power, will act, this redstone piece will activate this sticky piston and if you put this on top you activate that now if you empty this back to normal put water back in oh cool um what opened okay. i'll show you guys how to do it with the chest i'm pro yeah i'm pretty sure it works go to that yep it works the more blocks you have, the more amount of power you use. So now it should activate this. Now you're like, oh, I want to, what's it called? You, you want to close it? Take the item out. <laughs> I'll try to make this actually look good now.
imagine this is there's another whole side of this part, right? And I already go oh, I'm gonna open it. Quickly go inside and yeah, okay, let me focus on this. Actually look like that. Now I want to quickly close it. Take these three points out, and now um, it should be closed. Now, if you want to go out back outside, put the item back in. Mm. One sec. Yeah, it should work now. Boom. So that's how you make a simple cauldron slash chest. Um, cauldron slash chest a pile. So, oh my god, I'm gonna say cauldron slash chest secret door. Really easy. I'll show you it with the cauldron again. Just one more time. So, it doesn't just, for the chest, it doesn't just have to be um, spruce points. It can be any other item. Like, let me see. Um, sticky pieces. It still activates, right? Now, let's do this. Boom. Fill it in. Let's go inside. Quickly deposit it and then easy and yeah. I'll tell you guys more tutorials next time. So yeah, see ya. Bye.